Hey, what's up, guys? This is uh, Batosa369, and this is gonna be a commentary on Nuketown. Um, got the Galil, and this is a match I joined uh, with no one I know at all. I was kind of just going in there for the heck of it, and didn't, you know, have any expectation. And I kind of carried the team the whole time, and my kill streaks are really low, which is sad. Right off the bat, I get rocked by the kid that jumps out the window, and I almost left the match. I was kind of like, really? I'm not going to do good at all. I might as well leave, but I stuck it out, and I'm really happy I did because I got a really good gameplay out of it. And I was very cautious because I didn't know how this team played. Some teams run in groups of like three or four, and some teams go alone. And after a couple guys, I realized that uh, they're probably running alone, and most of these guys don't know each other, so it's good. Uh, the spawns are really, really crappy on this map. And this spot on the map is perfect for anybody because you can get the spawns that are back there and you can kind of just move around the inside of the garage. Like those guys had no chance. Um, this just this area patrolling it on either side is perfect because the people have to come to you and uh, they can't see you from a long ways away. Um, the corner I was at is perfect, especially if they're spawning behind you. These guys just aren't expecting me to be here, obviously. They, um,. They're just kind of running towards me, uh, and that's a problem. On Nuketown, you don't want to run through the middle ever. You kind of want to just stay on your side and shoot people from afar. That guy, that was sad. Um, the wall, um, I don't really know how I got that. I was just kind of thought he was going to be there and just shot, and it's just sad. But um, anyway, I got all my kill streaks already, and I pick up this AUG silenced, and I can't stand the AUG. It's... In my opinion, not very good. A lot of people like it, but I can't kill anybody with it. As you can see with a silencer, the damage is so low, I just can't do anything. So, I was kind of sad when I picked it up, and I tried for another wall bang, but it wasn't going to happen with the AUG silence. It just doesn't. I almost got killed by that grenade there, and I would have been really sad, but I didn't. Um, got that guy from a long ways off, and I'm thinking to myself, do I go throw my care packages, or do I try to kill some more people? And I just thought, you know, might as well just keep going how I'm going because right now we're tied and we're not doing that great um I was like you know we're probably gonna lose I'm probably gonna do really good and we'll still lose but as long as I'm confident we'll win so I just was like you know what I'm gonna go around find people and um but then I hear napalm striking I'm like oh no better run inside so I run back in my little hiding spot because yeah I guess I'm hiding a little bit I'm more or less patrolling this whole side of the map but some people call it camping um this, I was kind of sad I didn't get that guy. I probably could have. And then that guy, I got a hit marker. And then I pull out the gun that I hate. And that guy just kind of just was like, okay, whatever. That right there is awesome. That is so sexy. But then two guys are spawning right there and get me. But I was so excited when I got that. I was like, whatever. Either way, even if I don't get a gameplay out of this, it's a, it's a good clip. This, I don't see why I stood there. I still don't remember why I stood there for like six seconds. Because if I had enough, I think I could have surprised all those guys coming around the corner. And probably gotten a triple. So I really, really regretted it after that happened. Um, the kill streaks really don't matter on this map. That guy got a quad, by the way, if you didn't notice that. He got a quad grenade on my team, which is awesome. But um, I did get a... I do have hardline prone, so I do switch to this turret gun. I mean, sentry gun. And then I get a, uh, yeah, a counter UAV. So I'm... Not that yeah, great, but the sentry gun is really awesome on this map, especially if you set it near these fences, because guys will just not know it's there and come around the corner like that one just did, and then that one just did, and then that guy. So it's really helpful on this map. This guy up here in the window, I still don't see how he got didn't get me. I was like, okay. And use people you don't know to bait people out. Like that guy, he's not on my friends list. I don't know him. I was going to let him just get rocked and then just kill the guys. But I happen to save him anyway. Use people in your team to your advantage, especially if you don't know them and it doesn't matter how mad they are at you. Just, you know, if it'll help you out, go ahead and do it. Right here, I was kind of surprised I didn't hit anybody, but that's just how it goes. Um, I was really excited when I saw the red dots on the map because I was like, oh man, I'm about to get three or four people. And then that guy gets a grenade on the car, which I should have done. I really should have just thrown it at the car. And then the match is pretty much coming to an end. Um... I could have probably gotten a pretty good clip here, but that was the final kill of the match. That's how it's done. Nice job, team.